104.5 The Team, 104.5 The Team.com on the phone right now. Patch Albert, Clifton Park native, Boston College product, and now playing back locally with the Adirondack Thunder of the ECHL. Patch, you've, you've spent time in the ECHL in Elmira. You've spent time in Missouri. What is it like for you to be back playing here in the Capital Region? Uh, it's definitely a really cool experience. I mean, it's been a while since I was able to play uh, near home. So to be able to come back and be able to play in front of friends and family again is uh, really a cool experience. What's the environment been like in Adirondack? We know the Glens Falls area has a history of minor league hockey, but the Phantom's gone, the Flames gone. Now we've got the Thunder in. What's been the environment like in the first season up there? It's been uh, it's been great. I mean, the fans have been unbelievable. We've been winning a lot, so that obviously helps the cause, but uh, can't say enough great things about being up to the Pacific Center there. The ECHL is equated to, to double-A hockey, and we talk about minor league baseball, we have a familiarity with that grind, that lifestyle, the long bus rides, and, and just the, the, the incredible amount of time spent on the field trying to get ready to get to the next level. What's that like here for you in the ECHL? What's that grind like? Well, you just play a lot of games in a short amount of time. Like, I mean, last weekend we had a 3-3, three and three, so we played uh, two games at home, then Sunday morning we had to wake up early and drive over to Manchester and New Hampshire to play. Um, and then this week we got three and four, so we'll play tonight in, uh, at home against Elmira, and then we're driving down tomorrow morning down to Virginia to Norfolk. So, I mean, it's just, it's kind of like you get used to the bus rides and that kind of stuff, but that's where the, the true crime comes in at this level. We were talking off air, and I had to plead ignorance that, look, remember, I'm a baseball guy. I know how it works with affiliations when you're talking about AA, AAA to get up to the majors. But the ECHL is a, is a lot different. You spent time in Elmira, which is an affiliate of Buffalo. You spent time in Missouri, which is an affiliate of the Islanders. And now you're with Adirondack, which is a, an affiliate of the Flames. But you can still be traded by by the ECHL teams without it coming from from the, the, the NHL team directly, right? Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, obviously, there's the East Coast level, which would be equatable to uh, AA, and then the AHL, which the Albany Devils are, would be in, is uh, AAA, and then obviously the NHL team would be the, the major team. But uh, you can be under contract with just the AA team, and in that scenario, you can, you can very easily get traded from one AA team to another AA team. If you're under contract with the AAA team, it's a little more difficult, but it also could still happen. So you are playing for the Flames affiliate, but you are not property of the Flames, so any other team can, can come in and trade for you if they want to. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, that's, that's kind of the way it works. So we don't have a certain amount of guys that are under contract with the, uh, the main affiliated team, and other guys are just going to fill out the roster, and then they can get called up by any uh, AAA team that they want. What do you think you need to work on or improve upon in order for you to move up to the HL and possibly the NHL in the future? Um, I think just getting bigger and stronger and just thinking the game a little bit faster. Those are the, the, the three things that um, kind of everyone's always looking to do. Patch, the decision to become a hockey player at the highest levels does not come without sacrifice. And you said it's been a long time since you've played in the Capital Region. You you played at Shen for a couple of years, then transferred out. Now then we're talking prep school. You're talking junior leagues. Then you get to Boston College. Uh, the, the amount of travel needed to become a hockey player at the highest level is, is just is just extensive. What's that like? What's that grind like? It's definitely tough. I mean, you, uh, you miss out on a lot of things as a kid. Uh, like family, weddings, and all that kind of stuff. Um, and there's definitely a lot of sacrifices that, for your parents that they have to make to get you from one rank to the next. But uh, hockey's one of those sports that once you get the grip on you, you kind of you kind of stuck with it. And uh, I couldn't be happier for the be able to be playing at this level now and continuing to play uh, into the future. Patch Albert, Clifton Park native, won two national championships at Boston College, now playing in the ECHL for the Adirondack Thunder in their first season. Has the Thunder off to a great start. Patch, thanks for being with us. Congratulations on your success, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks for having me. I really appreciate it.